Fish on, fish on. Fish on. My brother's on, fish on, fish on. It looks like a good one. Yeah. pressure on it. Size has to be 21, 20 inches. This guy is 21 and a half, almost 22. Measure him one more time. Right there, 22 inches. 21, uh, 21 and a half. Let's keep her. Woo! Another one. Small, but she keeps. That one was on the same chrome, chrome flash. Come on, let's go. I knew it. I knew. It. Yeah, let him run. Come on. Don't fall. Over. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Got him. Keep tension on him. Keep tension on him. This is a good one. Let's go. Let's pull this out. This is a good one, Sergio. Fish on, fish on. Fish on, baby. Wow. Let's do this. This is what we were waiting for all day. Fish, guys, beautiful fish. Check it out. 
just amazing. Look at that. Let's measure them. That's our measure. 36, so he's about 38 inches. 38 inches. Beautiful fish. We'll weigh him right now a little bit. See how see what the weight is. Let me just get the uh the rods back in so we can try to get another one. <laughs> Woo! Two. Big boy and a small one. We got two. We need four more, but I don't know if we need to do it. We still got to head back. And as you know, we we're having a little bit of engine troubles. It's mostly, I think, my fuel line. As soon as we kind of bump it up in RPMs, it, it'll bog down and it dies. So I don't know how long it's going to take to get back in. But slowly. We'll take it slow and hopefully it works out. But as long as I keep squeezing or pumping that primer bulb, we can get it to cut back on. But it, it just keeps bogging down once we like just rev it up and just try to go get on plane. So keep trolling for a little bit longer. I don't know, maybe another five minutes, five, ten minutes. If we don't get no bias, we'll probably just call it a day and slowly head back in. Overall, nice day, not too bad. Weather's good. I wish I would have gotten out here a little bit earlier, but just an engine just wouldn't go. So, hey, okay, I'm still happy. We got two on the box and a few rockfish, so not bad. We're heading back home. We ended up with three salmon, three rockfish. So not not that much bad of a day for uh, for us having engine problems and everything like that. So we got a late start and we re really couldn't move around the way I wanted to. But I mean, we got three fish, so that's not too bad. We're heading back home right now and hopefully we'll see how long this, this engine lasts or how long it goes, but Right now, I'm, I'm going about 21, 21 knots, about 3,000 RPM. So, usually it, it gave me this for about three, four minutes and then it would just bog down. So hopefully, we can get back pretty quick, safe and easy, so we'll see. So as you guys saw the engine just bogged down this is what we're having to deal with and my primer bulb as you can see it just kind of goes flat we have to keep pumping and I think we have some sort of a leak somewhere but it just completely just died and it'll turn back on as long as we we pump it and we get like fuel back into it so we're gonna keep going at it trying to prime this bulb and try to get back home as soon as we can but and it's dead again so we're pumping it's non-stop we go for about four or five minutes cuts off pump it again prime the bulb go again so i don't know if you guys know what might be happening i'm thinking it's a leak so hopefully that's it but all right it'll take a while Slowly, but surely, we'll get home. Going and see how much that. 
trolled it at six and that uh, kind of got us in all the way. So we're trolling pretty smooth right now. No need to go fast, we're just gonna keep it nice and slow. Doing the final little rinse down and washing it. Gotta make sure she's clean. <laughs> 